and Ken. I too have known Terry for close to 40 years. He was many things to me. He was first, oddly enough, my babysitter. <laughs> kind of find that amusing that my parents had him watch the house and watch my brothers and I while they left town. It was the best days of my life. <laughs> then became a really great friend. He was like a big brother to me in many ways. And most importantly, a mentor. He brought me into the business, and I'm so grateful for that. He believed in me, and he guided me, and forever that I am grateful, Terry. We had the opportunity to say goodbye to Terry. And not many people get that opportunity when you know when you, when you know someone's gonna pass, or many a times we don't even know that they they're gonna pass. And with that said, we he called for Bob to come say goodbye or to have his last words. Well, he got more than just Bob. He got about 15 of us who showed up at the hospital. And it was a wonderful day. We were able to bring him out on the porch of the hospital after Terry explained to the, the nurses that it was hard to believe that they couldn't wheel the bed out onto the balcony. So they went out and they measured the door. And sure enough, they could roll the bed right out there. And it was an absolutely beautiful, glorious day. I'm a Christian, and I believe right about now, Terry is out of purgatory. <laughs> Has finished his Jack and Coke and is now in heaven. And I look forward to the day that I can see him again. So, to sum up that day, I wrote a poem. And it goes like this. Terry's bittersweet last lecture. It was bittersweet when you said to come. You summoned for one, but you got the whole sum. Delivering your last thoughts, you wanted to convey, because in the past, it was just another day. You took the bull by the horns and proceeded to speak. We laughed, we cried, and we sat in peace. You grabbed a hold of your destiny, that is for sure. You wouldn't let the disease take away that taco terry allure. We didn't want it to end as we knew this was it. The same our family now had to commit. One by one, we walked to your side holding our breath, then letting out a sigh. I asked how you knew, and then you replied, I feel warmth and comfort and peace inside. <laughs>